Hello, everybody. Mike from Southern California again, and you're on the mic. So today, it's Tuesday again, folks, which means that it's time for it's time for the anime convention preview for this for this weekend, November twenty second through the twenty fourth, in which I will highlight the convention scene for this coming weekend and tell you where some of your favorite voice actors and actresses will be. So, let's get started. For those of you in Albuquerque, New Mexico, if you, should, if you head over to the Embassy Suites by Hilton in Albuquerque, they will be hosting Con G Con in Con G Con 2019. It's an anime convention with gaming and video Gaming and video gaming programming. Um, Albuquerque's local anime, a, a, anime and gaming convention. We have a, we have new dates and a brand new location for year seven. Okay. Um, advanced rates. Um, they still have an advanced rate through the. Through November 23rd um, of $38.77. The outdoor rate for all three days is $40. $30 on Saturday, $25 on Sunday. So, um, yeah. Um, so, anyways, so, and in attendance there will be Faye Mata. Who is the who? Of course, is the voice currently the voice of Aqua in the in the Kono Suba series. Currently, the voice of Aqua in the Kono Suba series, including the spinoff Isekai Quartet. Um, she was also Neon Nostrade in the in the. Viz Media in the 2016 Viz Media dub of um, Hunter Hunter of the 2011 Hunter Hunter series, as well as um, she as well as she was voicing Yu Yukako Yamagichi um, in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Diamond is Unbreakable. Of course, the English voice English voice um, of these characters, Aqua from the Konosuba series. Um, Aqua from the Kono Kuba, Kono Suba series, um, Neon Nostrad in the 2011 Hunter Hunter series, the English voice of her, the English voice of Yukako Yamagichi in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Diamond is Unbreakable. So, moving on now, let's see what's next here. Okay, so for those of you in Wisconsin Dells, Wisconsin, if you head over to the Kalahari Resorts Dells, um, they'll be hosting Daishokan 2019 from this Friday the 22nd, 24th. It's an anime convention calling all geeks, nerds, gamers, cosplayers, and fans of all ages. Join us for a weekend of unrelenting geekery in 2019. Daishokan is leveling up over 6,000 Daishonauts. will gather at one of the most innovative and awesome geek events in the Midwest this November 22nd through the 24th. Whether you're a fan of Japanese animation, American animation, Asian pop culture, cosplay, video games, or tabletop games, you will find a way to celebrate your joy, compete in gaming tournaments in our video game room, participate Wisconsin's largest cosplay contest, and explore our mammoth vendor hall. We have Nerf battles, 
by day and EDM beats by night. Start your weekend at our cultural and community festival. Close it with an autograph from your favorite guest. Choose your own adventure, nerd. Find your passions and let your geek flag fly. So that's that's the gist of it. For those of you in Wisconsin, Dells, Wisconsin, if you want to head over there for Daisho Khan to the um, Kalahari Resort Dells. Um, the at door rates are like fifty dollars for all days, thirty five dollars for Saturday. Um, all the advance rates have already expired, and in attendance there will include Sean Shiplock, um, who currently voices Guido Mitsta in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure: Golden Wind. Um, also in attendance there will be. Aaron Dismuk, most famously known as the voice of Alphonse Elric in um, the English voice of Alphonse Elric in um, in the first Full Metal Panic series. Um, he's also Hibiki in Fate, in uh, not Fate, but um, in Fairy Tale. Um, then also we have. Um, Rico Fajardo, who is um, who is the voice of um, Mirio in My Hero Academia. Then you have um, Brianna Knickerbocker, who is the voice of Anna, the English voice of Anna in Promised Neverland. Promised Neverland. Um, then you have the husband and wife team of Brittany Lotta and Matt Chipman, who will be there. Brittany Lada, who is the voice of Yuzu Riha Ogawa, and Matt, who voices um, who voices Chrome in Doctor Stone. So, the husband and wife duo of Brittany Lada and Matt Shipman, who voice Yuzu Yuzu Riha Ogawa and Chrome in Doctor Stone. Let me see. Also in attendance, um, there will be Lindsay Seidel, who is currently the voice of <laughs> Najere Hado. The English, she's the voice of Najere Hado um, in My Hero Academia. This, I believe, is one of the characters that's been of con that's been of controversy lately. So Lindsay Seidel is the one who got lucky enough to voice her. So um, in My Hero Academia. So um, just keep bear that in mind. Um, also in attendance there will be Me Megan Shipman and Dave Trosco will also be in attendance there. Make. Um, Megan Shipman is the voice of the female form, the English voice of the female form of Grey uh, in Black Clover, and Dave Trosco is the voice, English voice of Ghosh in um, in My Hero Academia, uh, not My Hero, but Black Clover. You got some Black Clover, you got some Doctor Stone, you got some My Hero Academia. You know, um, so you guys might want to go over if you're in Wisconsin and you head over to. The until um, you head over to the Kalahari uh, Resorts, Dells, um, you can say hi, hi to them and let them know how much you appreciate their work. And finally, there are only like three cons that I felt. For those of you in Greenville, South Carolina, If you guys are into if you guys are into toys or maybe classic cartoons, like maybe if you guys are up, let's say in your you know late thirties, maybe forties, like I am, you um, and you remember when when there was a lot more toys that came in with your favorite cartoons, you might want to head over to the Embassy Suites by Hilton, 
Greenville Golf Resort and Conference Center in Greenville, South Carolina. For those of you in Greenville, South Carolina, um, Saturday and Sunday, November 23rd and 24th for Retro for Retro Toy Con 2019. Um, it's a toy show, two-day event with celebrity guests and toy dealers from around the country. The advance rates are 22, 29 through December, November 22nd. Doesn't say so what the outdoor rates are. For those of you who grew up in the 80s and grew up on 80s cartoons, um, Greg Berger will be there, who is, of course, the voice of Grimlock from the Generation 1 Transformers cartoon. Um, Larry Kenny, the first, obviously, the voice of Lion-O in the 80s Rankin-Bass um, production of Thundercats. He also played Claudius in the Thundercats um, 2011 remake, um, Lion O's Father. And then Morgan Lothing, who was the voice of the Baroness in the 80s um, G.I. Joe cartoon. So, for those of you in Greenville, South Carolina, you guys want to go check that out. For the, so those of you who are a little bit older, might be a fun, a fun day to be had. Anyways, with that being said, that's about the lot of the conventions going on this weekend that, um, basically the lot of the conventions this weekend going on. So, um, so with that being said, um, guys, if there's a particular voice actor or actress that you guys want at your local conventions, the way to do it is to contact your local conventions and politely and respectfully ask them to invite the invite your favorite guest. If if there's a particular voice actor that that you would love to meet at a con at one of your local cons, just contact your local convention and and ask them to to um, invite them. Do it in a very polite and respectful manner. Um, and with that, if you check the links below. Um, my Twitter handle will be down there. You can contact me directly. As you guys also know, I'm promoting a bunch of different dub companies. Um, because remember, guys, Funimation is not the only game in town. They may be the biggest game in town, but they're not the only game in town. If you want, you should go, and, you know, you might want to go and check some of the works out, some of the sites that I have listed there. And then I'm also, of course, still promoting the GoFundMes and tugs into GoGo -Go until the end of the month here when he decides to shut it down. Um, if, um, let's see. As always, guys, um, as always, guys, um, nobody wants to see you go bankrupt. They, um, Vic, Tug, and I'm sure the Ortiz family appreciates um, appreciates the support when you guys, if you guys can, but never feel like you have to donate. If it's on, if you have the ability to, and it's on your heart to do so, please consider donating. If you've already donated, please consider donating again. And if you're not in a position to donate, you can still help out the cause by sharing the links. Because sharing is caring, after all. Um, and you never know. Maybe there's somebody in your... Anyways, as I was saying, um, when you share it, you know, you never know. Maybe there's somebody in your circle of friends who might look at it and and say, you know, something. I want to help out too. So, um, so um, with that, you know, it doesn't hurt to ask after all. Um, the worst they can do is just say no. But, um, or just ignore it. <laughs> um, and also, if you guys like this content, please consider liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing, and hitting the notification bell for notifications. 
Um, I will always reply to you, you know, at, you know, particularly if it's a comment, you know, where you're asking me a question, I always look forward to having good conversations with you and also just helping you guys learn more about other options out there. Um, and with that, um, I hope to be chatting with you guys when this premieres later on tonight. If not, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.